Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Mibs, and welcome back on the channel. This is going to be the last time, and we all find out what is going on. Who is the monster? Ah, she can go just down. <laughs> no hiding. But she's small. Yeah, she's small. Yeah. All yellow eyes. Oh, I don't think she should be down there. They are everywhere. Hey, what are they doing here? I had no idea they were kids. Look, you, you don't have to worry. We're just having a wee bit of fun. Everything's under control here. You, you, you should go back to bed. Uh, I, I'm afraid. Uh, no, don't be silly. We're having a uh, good time. No, no need for worries. Uh, now, off to bed. Uh, okay. I can't sleep because of the noise. Uh, don't get cocky with me. It's not like uh, this happens every night. You know you uh, start to piss me off. Uh, this, I'm out of here. It's way past your bedtime. Why are you still up? I can't sleep because of the noise. There, there. Be alright soon. But it's very late. You should get back to your room. I'm afraid to close my eyes. It's alright. Just relax and try. You should go to your room and start sleeping. I tried to get sleep, but I just can't. Mm, maybe I should get going. I don't want to keep you awake. You take care of yourself, okay? Okay. Quite a big party, though. <clears throat> hey, you! Come here! Could you fetch me a drink? I've got a good thing going here. If you know what I mean. I can't go to the kitchen. Wait a minute! You're a kid! Where are your parents? Oh, How should I know? This is so irresponsible. This is so irresponsible. I'm gonna get out of here before someone calls the police. Interesting one by one, they find out. Ah, there's another one. I don't feel so good. You're, you're right. The last one was too much. I feel uh, terrible. Uh, are you right? Don't worry. Nope. Hand me a towel. Look. This happens every time. Time to put the cap on. <laughs> oh. And we can go out now. Okay. So I'm gonna go out. Thanks. 
Wait. Ah, Teddy. Oh, everyone is gone. I'm, I'm sorry for everything, but you got to trust me on this. Please, don't go outside. There's nothing but tears, Teddy. You didn't keep your promise. I know, and it breaks my heart. It really does. But you got to trust me on this. What's outside? Look, the monster wasn't what I expected. But now I know what it is. Don't go out there. I don't want you to get hurt. Oh, Teddy. That already happened. I know, and I'm sorry, but... I'm going to see the monster. Okay, but alone. Okay. Goodbye, Teddy. Goodbye. Okay. There's a lot of flies everywhere. There's nothing here. A Whoa. Well, well, I heard that you were looking for me. What took you so long? So, what are you doing here? You are the monster. I, uh, you should shiver to your bones. I've tried my best, giving you everything, but you just keep on disappointing me. No matter what I do, how hard I try, it's all about you. You think it's all about you, don't you? For once, step into my shoes and think what I've been through, what I had to suffer. I did it all for you and for what shame on you w what did i do isn't it obvious do i have to spell it out for you what? i can't believe you you honestly don't know what this is all about this is ridiculous don't you see you've ruined Everything. You forced my hand. I wouldn't be here if it weren't for you. I'm sick because of you. You really think I enjoy what I need to do just to survive? I'm the victim here. I live in hell, day in, day out. If it weren't for you, I would be still married. 
I wouldn't be alone, and I wouldn't feel miserable all the time. I wouldn't be sick. I wouldn't have to do this. Do you think I enjoy this? No, I... Uh, speak your mind. You don't mumble like that. This is your fault, not mine. You'll force my hand. I am... Um, just save it. I'm tired of your excuses. It's always someone else's fault. You just can't take any kind of responsibility. Responsibility. You just don't understand what it's like to live with this disease. I didn't choose this. I've had enough of you. You're the worst thing that's happened to me. You stole everything from me. I've given you my life and for what? To be left alone, old, broken and sick? I never asked for this. Please, stop. Be quiet. I can't take it anymore. Why do you do this to me? You just take and take and take. Until there's nothing left to give. To tell the truth, I wish you were never born. If I could do it all over again, I would change it all. Good. You better cry. You see? You find the monster just by looking at the mirror. This is not my fault. It's all you're doing. You should have stopped me. But you weren't there. But I guess it all worked out for you. You finally got what you wanted, didn't you? How could you do this? How dare you look at me like that? Here I am, laying half dead on hospital bed, and you dare to look at me like that. You should be ashamed of yourself. Don't you understand? I had no choice but to take those pills. And you weren't there to stop me. You have no idea what I've been through. And there you are, staring and judging me. I feel miserable enough already. I almost died. Can't you see? This was a cry for help. But you don't care about that. No, it's all about you. Why do you have to make everything about yourself? This isn't about you. It's me who's hurt, not you. You don't care about anyone else but yourself. You know, it's the other way around. It's always been that way. Nonsense! I've given everything to you, and this is how you thank me? I'm your mother, not some sort of monster. You're the most precious thing to me, and I can't prove it to you. And I can prove it to you. I've got a box full of photos. It wasn't all bad. You really think that a box full of photos will make everything all right? Just look at them. Those were good times. We, we were all happy. You, me, your father, everything was perfect. You can't be serious. I don't recognize myself in any of those. I can tell that without even looking at them. You just don't get it. But if you just... No. This is it for me. I can't take it anymore. Goodbye. Don't go, please. I swear, this is the last. I knew it. 
You just talk. You don't have the spine to leave. That's it. I'm done with you. Wait. Come back. Get back here. You can't blame me for this. Just look at the photos. I did the best I could. You'll see. If you just look at the photos, those were good times. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, this is the story about Lydia and her monster. I think we all have our monsters in our lives. And we all try to find them, whatever, hide them, obey them, or literally just push them deep inside us and never show them again. Yes, um, show the problematic of the alcoholism and the drugs in the family. And I'm sure that we're going to see more games from this group. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. If you liked the video, press the like button. And see you next time. Bye, bye, bye.